right now. And we go from the eighth one of the world, David, to double trouble. We've been talking about him being here, and it's Mark Lewin and Kevin Sullivan. Managed by Gary Hart. Hart wants, all right, nice move. Vinny Valentino, arm drag, comes up with that arm bar, applies that pressure. What a startling announcement made just a while ago by Ric Flair. Oh, yeah. Yes, that kind of, that would startle the wrestling world. However you know, David, Rick has been through a lot, and he's done and accomplished a lot. He's been a world champion. He's been world tag team champion. But he had a terrible plane crash, and he has also this injury, which, re which occurred recently at the hands of Horton Slater, and it injured the same part of his body that was hurt in that plane crash and I guess the man has uh, decided to to retire as he says and you know you got to make up your own you got to live with yourself you got to make up your own mind David I'm sure he took a lot of thinking before Flair came up to make a statement like that because he sure is one of the electrifying and exciting most wrestling it wrestler that ever entered, entered the ring, and it'll be a big loss to wrestling if we lose a star like Chris Flair to retirement. Oh, it really will. A it'll be a loss. A loss to the wrestling world to lose a champion the caliber but of you know, Rick we, Flair. We have seen Rick Flair for many, many years. Uh, David, he's always says whatever comes out of this mouth, you can believe, and you can put it in the bank. That is true. And we, now we hear that right out of Rick Flair's mouth, off his lips. And he's thinking heavily about a retirement. You can you can never replace an individual like Ric Flair. He's one of a kind. He went through a couple he a devastating injuries, and I guess he made up his mind, or he's really thinking about it. That's right. He either love him or hate him, but everyone out there respects Ric Flair, the man. Well, I'm sort of going to miss that woo of his. It's a sad thing to have to face uh, something like that, but... You know, the worst part about the whole thing is what will Orton and Slater do now? They will really gloat to high heaven over the fact that they caused Ric Flair to, to retire. John, what, what's going on? You've got, you've got people like Mark Lewin, Maniac Mark Lewin, Kevin Sullivan. You've got Baron Von Raschke in the area. He just he just tried went after Charlie Brown. Well, I'm He's sure nuts around that, that uh, Gary Hart has these two men. He also has the pair of Von Rasky, and he wants to get that mask off of off of uh, Charlie Brown and expose him because if he's able to do that, Bob Bagel has sworn his word as National uh, President Alliance of the NWA that he would suspend Jimmy Valiant if he was really actually, in fact, Charlie Brown. So we've got some, some real developments already in this hour of our program. The words that Ric Flair is strongly thinking about retirement and Ras Rasky and crew of Mark Lewin and Kevin Sullivan, who you see in the ring right now, have all managed by heart to be after that bounty and expose Charlie Brown to who he really is. But the man told me his name is Charlie Brown, and I believe him. He, he's, they told us that this is Mark Lewin and Kevin Sullivan. And that's what we'll call that too. All right, they're tagging this team. John, Double trouble, he calls them. It is trouble. Charlie Brown, I, I just don't know. John, again. It's Everything's changed. Everything's gone topsy-turvy. You know, our, our fans out there, they, they cheer. Is it, you know. Is that, that little extra something. Are the fans back there, are they giving it to him? You know, David, earlier they got that, that mask off of Charlie Brown, but they didn't really find out who he was. And That's right. I know that Rasky must have been gloating along with Hart, that he had to come out from under the ring, but we successfully got a coat around his head, and they could tell who it was. And I, I had the coat there, David, and I'll tell you, and i got to really be honest with you, the beard and the hair looks a lot, looked a lot like Jimmy Valiant, but I couldn't say if it yeah. was or who no. it wasn't. Couldn't be. I can't get over the announcement made by Ray. I, I, I can't even. I, I just. I can understand. I don't the understand. I, I can understand, too, how, how Rick feels, but I can't understand. The thing is, David, if, if, it, if it really comes to pass, 
and he does retire. You and I got to put up with the talk of Orton Slater. That's right. You, Orton Slater, Gary Hart, Mark Lewin, Kevin Sullivan, Baron Von Rasty, Harley Race. It just goes on and on. 